Good morning, you guys. I have been contemplating for like two months now on doing Vlogmas. Excuse me. I really want to try to do it. I like to watch other people's Vlogmas to a certain extent. I don't know if I could upload. Like, I know I could record every day a vlog. Yeah, sure. I don't know if I could edit it and upload and that kind of thing every single day. So, I'm going to attempt it. I'm going to attempt it, but it may end up being like Vlogmas, also known as I'm vlogging every two days or something like that. Every single day, y'all, I'm not doing much nothing every single day in order to vlog. I just know I'm not. Well, I don't think I am. I might actually be. I don't know. I don't know. It's too early for me to think. I have not been getting my sleep out for like a week, week and a half, maybe two. Well, no, I wouldn't say two weeks yet, but... Uh, especially the past couple days. I'm just, I just feel so groggy and just sleepy. And I know what the problem is. I just need to go to bed much earlier. Like I was at one point and I stopped doing that. Anyways, you guys. So today I have a lot to do actually. Hopefully, I'm hoping I can get it all done. One of my last headband wigs. Who y'all, y'all. Y'all don't know how tired I am of doing headband wigs. I honestly, like, I love them. I just did a red one, like a red-haired one, and I love that one. I was like, that's cute. I, like, overextended. I overbooked myself on accident, and, yeah, it just, it was all my fault. I have this thing with like not writing stuff down and not keeping track of what I agreed to. And by the time I knew it, I forgot stuff that I had already agreed to. And it was just like a lot. So <sighs> it is what it is. But I'm I'm the kind of person like once I say yes, I'm gonna do something, I'm not gonna backtrack and say no, I'm not gonna do it. You know what I mean? I just, yeah, I just totally messed up on that end, but whatever thank you guys who've been watching and supporting and all that kind of stuff so i appreciate it i'm supposed to start low carb today that's probably not gonna happen but for sure tomorrow i don't even have anything in the fridge to be able to start it at all i'm not doing keto i decided against keto but i want to stick to low carb I'm trying to decide what apps I want to do as far as training, as far as working out. I really want to get into that more in 2021. I just want to be a little bit healthier this year, especially this last half of this year. I've gained so much weight, y'all. I probably gained 15 pounds. I gained the quarantine 15. So the beginning of this year, around March, I lost, um, I lost maybe 13 pounds. 14 pounds and then by June I had gained it all back um and I really noticed it by June and this is the heaviest I have been in such this is like my baby weight this is how much I weighed this is how I looked when I had Isaiah that is not sitting very well with me but I'm not again I'm not beating myself up about it I haven't been beating myself up about it um but I don't like the way I feel I don't like taking pictures like full body pictures I don't like to you know like I'm just I'm just not comfortable with myself and I've been saying that for months now but I think I'm finally at a like a mental state where I'm ready to actually start the process and I've said this before in one of my vlogs some months ago that I wasn't quite happy with my weight and everything like that. But to me, when it comes to weight loss and a healthy life, a healthier lifestyle, um, or just trying, that's all it really is, just trying, it's all mental. So I had to, I knew I just had to wait because I couldn't just, every time I kept trying to dive into keto, dive into low carb, I'd be good for like two days and then I quit because I wasn't mentally ready. Like I just wasn't there. Now I think I am. And I know some people are going to be like, why are you starting during the holidays? Because I don't see a difference between now and January. I'm like, if I can get through the holidays, I can probably get through, 
you know, anything, especially December. That and there's not too much going on this year, especially with my family. We all stayed in our little homes for Thanksgiving. We normally all get together. So, you know, there's no parties I'm attending. There's no this, there's no that. So I should be fine. It should be just like regular, kind of regular days to a certain extent. So I'm looking for an app as far as working out to do because I'm having a lot of trouble just doing that on my own. All I do is like treadmill, I'll do some weights, jump some rope, and I'm like looking around like what else can I do? And then I just quit knowing what I'm doing is not enough. So I'm thinking about the Gage Girl training membership also thought about the tracy anderson method i think her method is method is a little bit different though so that's why i'm i'm intrigued by it and then there's also grow with joe i follow her on instagram we will see we will see but for now i need to get my life together y'all this house is a freaking disaster but that ain't gonna be today i'm gonna save that for probably tomorrow's monday Probably tomorrow I'll have a cleaning day. Isaiah's room is a mess. Oh my gosh. Anyways, all right. I'm gonna, I'll be back, y'all. I'll be back. All right, you guys. So I'm back already because I forgot my little case on my phone to vlog in the car and I wasn't coming back upstairs. I was already gone. Hey, Isaiah, Isaiah. Anyways, so <laughs> me and Isaiah went to Target and we got, I wouldn't even say a bunch of crap. We got a bunch of stuff, um, mainly just a few Christmas things, a few gifts and of course food for tonight. Oh, we are having tacos. I thought about that. Typically when I go to the store, why is this looking like this? I buy like all this food, <laughs> all this stuff and I come home with like nothing to eat for dinner. Because, because, like all the time. I do this all the time. So this year I wanted to give back. I actually wanted to adopt a family this year, but um, I wasn't, I hate to say I wasn't able to find one because, oops, oops, this is going crazy. I hate to say I wasn't able to find one because I'm sure there are plenty out there, but you gotta be careful, you know, these days with your money and people and, pretend, buy, and buying dogs and people pretending you know like they're in need and all that kind of stuff so i reached out to my aunt um and she helped me with finding children here in houston so kids who were less fortunate who just had a few things on their christmas list so i went and got that done so each kid you had to buy three gifts they requested three gifts and so I'm gonna show you guys what they requested. I had a, I had a boy and a girl. Um, I think the boy was 10. He wanted board games and house shoes. So I got him, well, I'm not taking them out, but I got him some house shoes. I just got these on Amazon. They're the hard um, like soles. So I got them in their gray boy stuff. And then I also got the Monopoly. I thought this would be fun. We should get Monopoly. We don't even have Monopoly. So I got him the Monopoly electronic gaming or banking, whatever it is, edition. And then I also got him this right here. This taboo speak out. And then I got little um, ornaments to go in each of their bags. The girl just wanted gift cards for arts and crafts. So I got one at Target, one Target gift card, and then tomorrow before I go drop the items off, I'm going to see if I can find a Michaels gift card in a Hobby Lobby. I really don't know where else to get arts and crafts from. I don't know if you follow Marie J here on YouTube, but she's someone that I've been following for a very long time. And I really like her. I think she's just very easy to watch. She's really down to earth. I don't know, I just really like her. She had on recently, I think it was her video like two days ago, this hey, robe from Target. Right. And when I saw it, like I wouldn't even pay attention to what she was saying. I was looking at the robe. I just knew I had to have it. So it looks like this. 
it looks really soft um, and it's from the stars above line so that you'll know but I'll link it down below as well it's kind of like this off-white it kind of looks a little bit warnish but it looks super cozy I got mine in a medium large because they didn't have um, um they didn't have small medium at the store for pickup so if this doesn't work, then I'll just have to order it online and have it shipped in a small medium. But other than that, that is pretty much all we, all, yeah, all we shop for today. Tomorrow, I am probably going to start putting up stuff, like decorations, and probably going to Home Goods. So hopefully tomorrow, because this is all I'm doing today. This video was pointless today, but whatever. Um, hopefully tomorrow I'll bring my stuff so that I can vlog that and I can take you guys with me to Home Goods and TJ Maxx probably. So that's it for tonight. All right, good morning, y'all. It is Monday uh, and I am on my way to take Isaiah to school. We are late today because we did not get up. On time I didn't get a drop of sleep I don't know why no I was just tired being first day of my cycle um, I didn't sleep at all I'm pretty sure I slept like two hours I am extra tired but taking day day to school Today I have to drop off the angel package which I was telling you guys about yesterday the um, YMCA for the gifts I have to drop that off this morning oh, I don't feel like driving anywhere and then I need to drop off um, my fashion file I have to show you guys my shoes my fashion file um, sandals I got there's some YSL sandals, but they did not fit me. I've been wanting sandals forever. And they're so narrow, it's like ridiculous. So I'm returning those and then I can head back home. I need some coffee. I need some iced coffee. That's what I would like to have at this moment. Um, I planned on, today was supposed to be, I'm be honest, I'm so tired. Today was supposed to be my first day of my workout. <laughs> I don't know if today's going to be my first day. Yes. Oh, okay. Even though you're feeling this way, that way, blah, blah, blah. It should be your first day. No, I'm tired. I want to. All I want to do is drop this stuff off and go back to bed. So. <laughs> you know what today is? You got it. You did? There's always a cop right there. Like, y'all do not speed on this street. Always a cop. You don't speed on this street. No, I never speed on this street. The cop is always on the certain street. It's like two different streets. But they blend in with like all the trees and stuff. Ooh, girl, you gonna get your Mercedes toe up. Y'all get a toe up, ma'am. Um, but he like, you know, he has on black and then the trees and stuff. It's a lot of trees over here. Um, so he blends in with the trees and the bushes and all that kind of stuff. He's not hiding at all. He just blends in with them. And nine times out of 10, um, he's always, whatever cop is right there, they're always outside of their car. Um, what you call it? With their, with the gun, like. They gonna clock you. You better slow down. What are you doing? Y'all, y'all better learn how to drive today. What's wrong with these people? Ooh, I need to wash my hair. OMG. What's happening, baby? We still got this car seat in the back. Oh, Isaiah got a new car seat. Have we shown him your new car seat? No. We gotta take this big old one out. We need to put it storage y'all 
so I'm at the UPS store. But I wanted to show you guys my shoes that I'm taking back oh, from Fashion File real quick. My Saint Laurent. Oh, I've been dying for these. And if you don't know what Fashion File is, it's pretty much you find um, used luxury items okay sometimes they're used sometimes they are not um sometimes they're brand new and people just sell them and sometimes they have probably been worn maybe once um maybe once or twice or something like that and people sell it bags shoes accessories fendi louis gucci chanel all those all those and i bought from fashion file a couple times so these are the shoes i thought these are really cute y'all don't do heels so i just did the flats okay y'all know everybody has these um ysl sandals right but like they have the heels i don't do heels i'm going over with heels i'm doing all that but i've been wanting these sandals forever but FYI, they are so narrow. And I wear a size, like Adidas shoes, which is typically what I wear. I wear a size five and a half. And other shoes, I wear a size six. So I don't have a large foot at all. And my foot is pretty average as far as width goes too. And for the life of me, I did not understand why these were so tiny, but whatever so I'm going back in the bag and get my couple hundred dollars back okay I have some busy days ahead of me like I've been to the dentist this week is this going to UPS store oh yeah <laughs> why am I at the UPS store um I have to get to the dentist this week and then Isaiah is taking pictures. He has a little mini photo shoot. He has some Christmas minis happening um, on Saturday. So he needs to get a haircut Friday. So I'm be at my brother's Friday, Christmas mini Saturday. Wednesday is the dentist. We got a pretty busy week. I think today I'm just, I'm probably gonna end up cleaning up Isaiah's room. I do like to clean up when he's there with me. We clean up together. But y'all, his room is a complete mess. And I just don't know if we will both get around to it. So sometimes, mamas, y'all feel me. I'm just cleaning up myself. You know, sometimes we can both do it. Sometimes we can't. It is what it is. Yeah, it's it's like 11 o'clock. 11.03 to be exact and I dropped off the um, angel tree gift so I did that got the rest of my gift cards the Michaels gift card I was looking for for the little girl not the little girl she's like 14 <laughs> and then I went dropped that off at the downtown YMCA went to Kroger went to CVS looking for gift cards and I got food for tonight um I was gonna wait until Isaiah <laughs> like tomorrow to come to home goods but y'all sometimes I can't focus with him I know I love shopping with him and stuff he hates shopping these days by the way but I just can't focus and I didn't want to be all day lot all day the last time we had fun but I was like, if I can get some quiet time at Home Goods and take my time to myself, then I'm going to take advantage of it. And that's what I'm doing. So let's go. All right. I'm ready. <laughs>
I want something like this for the bedroom, but I'm afraid once you wash it, it's not going to stay all comfy and cozy. Cause that would be cute for the room. Hmm. I might just get it. Nope, that's a queen. Let's see if we can find a king. Okay, this is cute. Has a little bit of texture on it. It's an eight piece comforter set. It's like this. Oh, it's like this light tannish kind of color. I like this. I think I'm gonna get this one. I like the look of this. All right, y'all, so I am back at home in Isaiah's room. It is like 2.50. So almost three and we pick him up around four, 4.30, just depending. And this is his room. It's a disaster. It's not hard to clean up. His room is never hard to clean up, but the closet is horrible. Um, yeah, it's just, Y'all, it's literally just crap. It's just crap everywhere. So, I'm about to clean it up as best as I can. His room is already tiny. I think he's starting to realize just how small his room is. Because he talks about it now. <laughs> he doesn't like to be in here. Because it's so small. But he's like into doing all the karate and playing with his swords and all that stuff like uh it's no space one day one day get my baby the bedroom he deserves Good morning you guys it is Tuesday today's Tuesday um, we are about to just put the tree up we're putting a tree up today and we're, decorating. I, and we're decorating Isaiah and I first we've got to clean up the living room it's not a complete disaster but we need to clean it up and then we'll pull out the tree decorate and all that good stuff so let's get started <music> This is a little corner I'm about to show y'all. It's full of wires and stuff because as techy as somebody is, I'm not gonna name no names, we sure do have poor cable management in our house. I have to get a tree skirt still. There is, I'm looking for like a white fluffy one. I'm just gonna have to order it from Amazon. I went yesterday 
and the day before to try and find one from Target and Home Goods. Couldn't find one. I don't really know how I want to do a tree this year. I'm not like super tree savvy when it comes to decorations <laughs> and stuff, but it is what it is. You gotta make some cookies for Santa. this down <laughs> all right okay we're just finishing up all right y'all so we finished our tree our basic tree um i've had the same ornaments the same everything for like three years now and i have not changed it i thought about changing this year but honestly I'm just ready for a whole new, like, I just want a big, massive tree and, you know, new decorations and all that kind of stuff. But this works. For the third year in a row, this works. I'm also getting a new rug should be coming in this week. And then I think on Thursday or Friday, we'll end up putting up the rest of the stuff. Or I may just do it and then show you guys what I end up doing. This is like Disney. We do look like this. Anyways, that's it. Bye. Dingle bells, dingle bells, dingle on the way. Hoping I can get this smile, open, open, smile. Dingle bells, dingle bells, dingle on the way. Hoping I can get this smile, open, open, smile. Hey.